Hey loves, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna I'm gonna give you guys word. If you're new here, comment like and subscribe. The reason why you should like the reason why you should subscribe here is because I'm gonna give you guys word. So we're gonna jump right into what it says. Um, it says looking for the perfect friend. You may set your you may be setting yourself up for disappointment even your most faithful but good time can can let you down but can let you down even your most faithful but can let you down sometimes only god is a hundred percent trustworthy so even one of your closest friends could like not be there for you not always have a like thing to say to you or something uplifting to say to you but you know who does care for you you know who's always been to your friend even though your friends being like not really your friends for real um god is really your friend you can trust him with pretty much anything you tell him anything anything that you want to tell him he's not gonna be like that's insane or that's weird that you want to do that or that's crazy or you know just judging you he's not gonna do that he's gonna understand why you feel like that and He's going to make sure that, you know, whatever you asking him for, he's going to give it to you. He's not going to be like, oh, well, I don't think you should want that. Or I don't think, like, question you on it. He understands why you want it. And he understands why you're asking for it. So it's not going to be nothing that he judges you for. God loves you. And he wants you to put your trust into him and stop putting your trust into people. That's why he be saying, like, stop trusting people with your problems. Stop trusting people with all the stuff that you go through. And trust in me because I know you more than your friends know you. They they just seen you. I been knew you before I brought you to this earth. I been knew you. I know how you was going to be. I knew what you was going to look like. I knew what you was going to put on. I knew if you were going to have hair or not. I knew all this stuff about you. I knew you were going to be smart. I knew you were going to believe in me. I knew all this stuff about you. So it's like, I, it's nothing that God doesn't know about you. That's why I'm saying, tell God everything that you're going through or been through. And he's going to always help you at, at the end of the day. I always pray every single day. It's the key to happiness. Like the key is, if you want to be happy and fulfilled and successful in life, you have to start with the number one thing. And that's prayer. Without prayer, you would be lost. Without prayer, without God, you would be lost. Without God, you would be nothing. Without God, I would be nothing at the end of the day. I am nothing without the Father. He gives me the strength to post these videos. He gives me the strength to uplift other people. He gives me the strength to be the best advocate that I can be for him. Because I am an advocate for God. And meaning, I'm an advocate for God. Meaning, I can speak for God. So, I can tell you, like... You know, God wants you to talk to him, but I can't tell you what he's going to do. But, because it's like, I don't know what God's going to do. I don't. I, at a sense, I do. Like, I, a sense, I know, like, um, I know that he's going to answer your prayers. But anything else other than that, I don't know what God's going to do today. I don't know what he's going to do tomorrow. I don't know any of that. But I know that God is a way maker. And he hears you. And he loves you. So, whatever you're requesting or you're praying about or you're telling him about, he heard you the first time you opened your mouth and was like, I want this, I want this, I want that. Like, like I said, when you talk to God, think of it as Christmas. So, you know, y'all want a lot of stuff for Christmas. You know, you want a lot of things because you don't just want one thing for Christmas. You want a lot of stuff for Christmas. So, go to God like that. Be like, God, I want this car. God, I want this house. God, I want this relationship. God, I want this, um, this wedding. God, I want this dream house. God, I want all this stuff, whatever. Tell God all your needs that you want and he will supply all your needs. Tell God every need that you desire in your heart, and he's going to fulfill it. He's, meaning he's going to give you the desires that you are. He's going to give you exactly what you asked him for. But remember to have faith in what you're asking for. Remember to know that when you're asking for these things, remember that they will come to you unexpectedly. Meaning they will come at the time you think that God didn't hear you. They will come at a time when you think that you lost all hope. They will come at the perfect time. Our time means nothing. God's time means more. So God is going to help you out in those areas of your life that you need help in. Do not doubt that man. Do not. Do not. Because he loves you and he cares for you each and every day. Understand this when I'm telling y'all this. Like, I doubt God. Yes, I do at the end of the day. I'm not finna sit here and tell y'all I don't doubt God just because I'm 
Christian and I believe in God at the end of the day. I doubt God too, but at the end of the day, I repent to God and I tell God, I'm sorry for doubting you. I'm sorry, sincerely, I'm sorry for doubting you. You know what? God looks at my heart and he knows that I'm really for real. He knows that I'm not joking with him. He knows that I'm not saying that just for him to feel sorry for me or whatever. He knows when I say I'm sorry, like I'm really, really sorry. He knows like, okay, she's being sincere now. Like she really, she's really a sorry, especially like when I'm crying to him, he knows when I be crying. I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And I keep saying it like he knows I'm being for real with him. So, you know. Trust in God. He's the only person that you can go to when you're going through hard times. You cannot go to your friends at the end of the day. Stop going to them. Because they don't care for you anyway. So you be going to these people thinking they care for you. But in reality, God cares for you. He really do. Because the same people that's, that you're telling your business to be the same people tell somebody else what you're crying about. Tell somebody else what you're sad about. So if you're going to tell anybody anything, tell God, Okay tell him because he's really going to help you and he's really going to, you know, come through. And he's going to make sure that the situation that you're facing now gets better for you. So if this vlog makes sense to you guys, let me know down in the comment section. I'm going to end the vlog here. Give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and it brought you confirmation to your situation and know that your healing and your blessing and your prayer will be on the way and it will be answered today. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Keep God first place. Remember, remember, God loves you. I love you all too. Bye, loves.